Okay, I'm going to be making this third video on this subject, and I'm going to be set setting the other ones for unlisted. Um, because I, you know, that's before I knew how this new system worked. Um, <clears throat> it is what they were advertising, um, but they did not say that the new system would be completely replacing the old system. They made it sound like it was going to be in addition to, but you know, at least you know, at least you don't have to post to Google Plus. So. Um, the advantages, there's, I mean, you have all the advantages of the commenting system for Google+. Plus. You're not limited to the 500 character limit anymore. I mean, that was a redundant sentence, but, uh, you're not limited to that anymore. You can do hashtags, you can do a number of things. And if you want to post to Google+, Plus, want the comments to be on Google+, Plus, you can do that too. So, you know, it, it, it has some neat advantages. And the, and the channel owners are able to, uh, control the content that is on that is in the comments uh, more than they could before. So, you know, it's... I think in general it's it's going to be a good thing. It just... They really should have said that um, once this is in place, you cannot make comments on older YouTube comments. They, they should have specified that, but... Eh, you know... Growing pains, I guess you could call it. Um, I think overall this is going to be a good thing, so...